Statue of the Seven. There are a few of these statues scattered across the land to show the Seven's protection over the world. Among the Seven Gods, this god controls the wind. Paimon's not... Paimon will take you to the Animal God's place first, and there's a reason why. As we all know, poetry and language flow like the wind. There'll definitely be someone there who knows about your sister. At least that's what Paimon thinks. Whether the gods actually answer you is a different story. You never know unless you try. So let's hop to it. You just feel the elements of the world? Seems all you had to do was just touch the statue and you got the power of Animo! As much as they may want it, people in this world can never get a hold of powers as easily as you. Uh-huh! It's because you're not from this world to begin with! If we keep heading west from here, we'll eventually reach Mondstadt, the City of Freedom! Mondstadt is the city of wind because they worship the god of Animo. So perhaps because you got power from the god of Animo, you can find some clues there. There are also lots of bards there, so perhaps one of them has heard news of your sister. Let's move then! The elements in this world responded to your prayers and Paimon thinks that's a lovely sign. Wind blade. Like the wind. These are the animal powers you got from the statue of the seven. Oh, Paimon's so jealous. Why doesn't Paimon get cool fighting powers?
Take a close. Be careful. Paimon doesn't have a good feeling about this. <sighs> Paimon's never seen a stone like this before, so Paimon can't tell what it is. All Paimon knows is that it's dangerous. Best we put it away for now. Okay, we've got it. Now let's get out of here. God protect you, stranger. I am Amber, outrider for the Knights of Favonius. You don't look like citizens of Mondstadt. Explain yourselves. Well, we're not looking for trouble. That's what all the troublemakers say. Doesn't sound like a local name to me. And this mascot, what's the deal with it? I mean, we've only been traveling partners for two months, but... We've already become the very best of friends. So to sum it up, you're traveling partners, right? Well, look, there's been a large dragon sighted around Mondstadt recently. Best you get inside the city as soon as possible. It's not far from here. I'll escort you there. Oh, aren't you out here for some other reason? I am, but not to worry. I can keep you both safe while doing that too. Besides, I'm still not sure if I can trust you two just yet. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Probably not something I should say as a knight. I give you my apologies, uh, strange yet respectable travelers. That sounded so fake! Do you have something against the type of language usage prescribed by the Knights of Havonius Handbook? Suspicious travelers, what are you doing in Mondstadt? He got separated from his sister during a really, really long journey. Paimon is his travel buddy, helping him to find his sister. <laughs> 